Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I was in the no frills of my childhood and I actually went to use the washroom and lo and behold, right across from the washroom door was the clearance shelf. I spotted the bargain when I came out of the washroom, but I'm gonna show that to you last. Let's start with the candles. These are $9 each, and they seem to have three varieties. I have been looking for this type of candle at Value Village, and it's been really hard to find lately. Given this is a clearance shelf, I don't find $3.99 for the cheese. It's much of a bargain. So I think I'm gonna pass on that. So we have cookies and a taco kit 50% off and a gingerbread house. Oh, we've got some tinned jalapenos for a dollar. And there's three of them. I'll take all three. Let's see the best before date. Well, it's not on that side. Okay, it looks to be sometime in 2025. Some clubhouse rice flour for $1.54. That's a pretty small package. Some quick rice yeast, and they're charging $3.44 for it. I'm good for yeast though, I have enough. There's the uh, gum of my childhood. We've got some sort of cereal-ish bars. More candies and gum. These containers of matcha for $14.94. Now, just below that on the shelf are jars of Jif for $3.97. Here's some boxes of cereal. This box of checks is broken. I'm presuming what's on the inside is sealed. Cinegram Toast Crunch. These boxes are both 50% off. And here we have Quaker Harvest Crunch. They're charging $4.99 for this size package. Now we have a lot of this at home, but this is a pretty good price for this product. Some donut tins, they're charging $11.99 each. I don't know if I would pay that, considering I've seen this in Value Village. 50% off a bag of rice. I'm not familiar with this brand. And we've got some finish, 50% off. Hmm. Some hamburger helper to the left. This is something I've never heard of before. Milked cashews, not to be confused with cashew milk because that box did not feel like there was fluid in it. Now they're charging 274 for this small package of green tea. I'm sure there's not many green tea bags in that package. And $2.94 for a mini container of Lysol wipes. Wow, while I didn't see this before I went into the washroom, it was the first thing I saw when I came out. $2.24 for a pack of Bernardin regular mouth lids. I can't believe it. It's cheaper than Dollarama where you pay $2.50. So I'm not doing the haul at home today. My apartment is a wreck because I'm getting ready for a renovation. I purchased five packages of the Bernard and Regular Mouth Lids. I do have a good amount at home, so I'm just gonna leave it at that. Each package was $2.24. I purchased three tins of the La Costeña jalapeno peppers, a dollar each. The gingerbread scented candle was $9. Oh, there's a siren, man. I'm doing a voice over here. Whoa. Okay, the siren's all done now. 
So I did not end up getting the quantum finish because when I took it off of the shelf, I didn't realize it didn't have a lid. Now, if I had some of this at home where I could reuse a lid from an old bottle, it would have been well worth the 50% off price, which was somewhere between five and six dollars. On the other hand, I guess I could look for some sort of bottle at home, but to be honest, I can't be bothered. Let me know what you think about the deals I got from the clearance shelf today, and I thank you for watching.